Suspicious packages are anything that looks out of the ordinary. It's a box, for example, that has excessive amounts of tape on it. It could also be a backpack left in a strange place, something that's not normally where you would see a backpack sitting. If you do see a suspicious package, you want to immediately call 911 and report it. Again, anything that looks unusual or out of the ordinary. When you call 911, you want to be able to give them some information. You want to tell them what you saw, why it looks suspicious, where it is, and be as specific as you can there. You should stay nearby so that when the police officers respond, you can point the object out to them, you can explain to them how you found it, why you think it's suspicious, and answer any follow-up questions that they have. Cruise Alert allows us to send out a message to the campus via a number of different paths. We can send out calls to campus telephones, cellular telephones, home telephones, and other phones that members of the campus community have registered. We can also send out emails and text messages, and Cruise Alert also ties in with some of our other systems like KZSC Radio, our emergency messaging signs that we can put up at the base of campus. Blue light emergency phones are another way that people on campus can get in touch with campus dispatch during an emergency situation. Because of the way our campus is with our tree cover and our hills, cell phones don't always work. Other times we may have so many people trying to use a cell phone at the same time that this, you can't get a signal. So blue light emergency phones are a way that you can get directly in contact with campus dispatch. It's the exact same thing as calling 911. These boxes are located around different places on campus. After dark, they're lit up with a blue light. All of them are very simple devices. You open the box. Some of the models that we have have what are just a regular telephone handset. If you pick up that handset, you're connected directly to dispatch. Other devices have a push button. If you push the button, it connects you directly to campus dispatch. It's the exact same thing as using, it's calling 911. You should consider this just like calling 911, so you should not use it for any non-emergency purposes. We have a campaign on this campus called See Something, Say Something, Do Something, which is very much uh, in line with the national effort for people to report suspicious activity and suspicious persons. We encourage everyone on the campus, if they see something suspicious or they hear something suspicious, um, or they feel uneasy about a situation that they call the police department so that we can come out and assess it. Um, we will never come back and say, oh, you should have never called, but we would rather uh, deal with the problem up front be before somebody gets hurt. Um, again, so the campaign is called See Something, Say Something, Do Something, and that's, that can be done either by using your cell phone to call 911, you can use a landline phone or a telephone from an office, you can use a blue light phone or even an elevator phone to contact us.